Is it the right time to make a move on Tesla stock? In this video, we will be delving deep into the world of Tesla. Our initial report was published on our website on Thursday, October 26, 2023. Today, we are here to provide you with an even more detailed analysis. Make sure to subscribe, like this video, and turn on the notification bell to stay updated on our latest analysis. It's important not to miss any crucial updates that could impact your investments. Take your trading decisions to the next level by trying out our newly launched AI stock analysis tool, powered by GPT-4, at stockinvest.us. Unlock the power of artificial intelligence and get free price predictions and in-depth analysis for any of the 25,000 companies worldwide today. Please note that this video is for informational purposes only and should not be considered as financial advice. As of October 12, 2023, our system has identified Tesla as a sell candidate, with a score of minus 2.50. Now, let's delve into the stock's performance during this period. Over this time, the stock has experienced a loss of minus 20.52%. This means that, on average, it has been losing minus 1.87% per day since it was flagged as a sell candidate. The stock has broken a significant downward trend and is currently falling. Although there may be temporary breaks and sell-offs, a further decline is expected. Any rebounds to the breaking point of $208.07 should be seen as an opportunity to exit. According to the fan theory, the new bottom line of the next trend could be $144.73, but it is too early to confirm this. Looking at the three-month trend, there is a potential minus 3.52% change over the next three months, with a possible return ranging from minus 2.44% to 27.26%. In terms of the 12-month trend, there is a projected 51.76% change over the next year, with a potential return ranging from 46.73% to 139.56%. This translates to a price range of $301.90 to $492.91 after a year. Our latest update for Tesla brings some important news. On Thursday, the stock experienced a decline of 3.14%. The Tesla stock price dropped from $212.42 to $205.76 on that day, a decrease of 3.14%. Throughout the trading day, the stock fluctuated between a low of $204.88 and a high of $214.80, representing a 4.84% change. In the past 10 days, the price has fallen in six instances, resulting in a total decline of 20.52%. Interestingly, although the volume of shares traded increased by 9 million on the last day, the prices were falling. This could be an early indication of increased risk in the upcoming days. Overall, approximately $23.40 billion worth of Tesla shares were bought and sold, with a total of 114 million shares exchanged. Let's take a look at the stock's performance over the past year. The highest price recorded in the last 52 weeks was $299.29, while the lowest was $101.81. Currently, the price is 31.25% below the 52-week high, equivalent to a difference of $93.53. Furthermore, it is 77.15% below the all-time high, which occurred on January 25, 2021, when the stock reached $900.40. Today, we'll be discussing some recent analyst ratings for Tesla, symbolized as Tesla. First, on Tuesday, October 3, 2023, GLJ Research gave Tesla a sell grade with a hold action. Next, on the same day, Morgan Stanley gave Tesla an overweight grade with a hold action. Turning back to Friday, September 29, 2023, Wedbush gave Tesla an outperform grade with a hold action. Going further back to Friday, September 22, 2023, Cowan and Company gave Tesla an outperform grade with a hold action. Lastly, on Monday, September 18, 2023, Goldman Sachs gave Tesla a neutral grade with a hold action. Analysts have given Tesla stock a general rating of strong buy. The P.E. ratio and price to book for Tesla stock are both rated as strong buy. However, when it comes to return on investment, the analysts give the stock a rating of neutral. 
Today, we'll be discussing the signals indicating the current state of Tesla's stock. Unfortunately, there are few to no technical positive signals at the moment. Both short and long-term moving averages suggest a negative forecast for the stock. Additionally, the relation between these two signals presents a general sell signal, with the long-term average positioned above the short-term average. If the stock experiences any upward corrections, it will face resistance at the lines marked at $217.37 and $249.74. However, if it manages to break above these levels, it will issue by signals and indicate a potential upward trend. We saw a sell signal being issued from a pivot top point on Tuesday, October 10, 2023, resulting in a minus 21.95% fall so far. The stock is expected to continue falling until a new bottom pivot is found. Furthermore, the three-month moving average convergence divergence, MACD, currently indicates a sell signal. It's worth noting that volume rose on falling prices yesterday, which could be seen as an early warning sign. It's important to closely monitor the stock in light of this development. In this video, I'll be sharing some other signals that you might find interesting. Let's start with the moving average convergence divergence, which is currently indicating a sell signal. Next, we have the pivots, which gave a sell signal 13 days ago. The Bollinger signals a buy signal 5 days ago. The short-term moving average shows a sell signal 12 days ago. Similarly, the long-term moving average indicates a sell signal 11 days ago. When we look at the relation between the short and long moving averages, it shows a buy signal 8 days ago. Now, let's analyze the 12-month chart. The short moving average gave a buy signal 9 days ago. However, the long-term moving average shows a sell signal 8 days ago. The relation between the short and long moving averages suggests a buy signal 7 days ago. If you want to discover more signals, be sure to visit our page at stockinvest.us. Today, we'll be discussing the support, risk, and stop loss for Tesla. Before we dive in, let's talk about support. Unfortunately, there is no support from accumulated volume below today's level. This means that if certain conditions align, the stock may perform poorly in the next couple of days. Moving on to risk. Tesla is considered a high-risk stock due to its volatility. It has the potential to experience significant price movements throughout the day. In fact, the Bollinger Band indicates a large prediction interval for this stock. Let's look at some numbers. Yesterday, Tesla's stock price fluctuated by $9.92 between its high and low, representing a 4.84% change. Over the past week, the stock has shown an average daily volatility of 4.68%. Before we dive into the potential trading levels for Tesla, it's important to understand some key fundamental data. Let's start with the price-to-earnings ratio, or P-E ratio. This ratio compares a company's current share price to its per-share earnings. A high P-E ratio could indicate that the stock is overvalued or that investors are expecting significant future growth. Moving on, the next earnings report for Q4 2023 is scheduled for January 24, 2024. Analysts' consensus estimates for this report are at 86 cents. It's crucial to keep an eye on these figures as they can have a significant impact on stock prices. Today, we'll be discussing some important day trading levels for Tesla. In the case of an upward trend, the first resistance level for Tesla is set at $211.99. If you currently don't own any shares, it might be wise to wait for this level to be surpassed before entering a position. On the other hand, if you're already holding the stock, this could be a level worth considering for swing trading. It's important to note that there isn't much support from accumulated volume below, which means the stock could potentially experience a sharp decline under certain circumstances. Therefore, it's crucial to exercise caution and consider placing bets only if you're an experienced trader who knows how to navigate such situations. According to multiple analyst sources, Tesla has received a strong buy rating on average. Now, let's delve into some recent insider trades. On October 6, 2023, Taneja Vibov sold 4,000 shares of non-qualified stock option, right to buy. On October 6, 2023, Taneja Vibov bought 4,000 shares of common stock. 
On October 6, 2023, Taneja Vibov sold 4,000 shares of common stock. On September 27, 2023, Baglino Andrew D. sold 10,500 shares of non-qualified stock option, right to buy. On September 27, 2023, Baglino Andrew D. bought 10,500 shares of common stock. Based on the 100 most recent insider trades, the insider power is positive with a ratio of 63.852. Overall, insiders have purchased 2,528,625 shares and sold 487,072 shares in the last 100 trades. We have evaluated this stock negatively and unfortunately, no stop loss has been set. Is Tesla stock a good buy? Let's analyze Tesla's current situation. Unfortunately, Tesla holds several negative signals and is within a very wide and falling trend. This suggests that it may continue to perform weekly in the next couple of days or weeks. So, our evaluation of this stock is negative. However, after carefully analyzing the volatility and movements for the last trading day, our systems find that the current price is undervalued. Looking ahead to Friday, October 27, we expect Tesla to open up $2.72 and start trading at $208.48. Before we begin, it's important to remember that trading carries a high risk of financial loss. It's always advisable to consult a financial advisor before making any investment decisions. Please note that StockInvest.us should not be the sole basis for your investment choices. By using the information provided, you acknowledge and assume responsibility for your own investment decisions. Welcome to Stock Invest. Today, we'll be sharing our current view on this stock. We want to hear your thoughts too, so don't forget to comment below. What is your target for this stock? Let's dive in and explore together. But before we begin, if you find our content valuable, remember to like and subscribe to our channel. It helps us bring you more insightful stock analysis like this. Alright, let's get started. Here's our take on the stock. Do you agree or disagree? We'd love to hear your perspective, so make sure to leave a comment below. And finally, we want to wish you successful trading and a beautiful day. Thank you for joining us here at Stock Invest.